Jim Brown has passed away Man. at the age of 87. God bless you, Jim. Jim Brown, arguably the best running back of all, or the best player of all time. Things that he was able to do in terms of where segregation was, in terms of where the civil rights, in terms of where inclusion was not uh, at the time that he was coming up, whether it was on the football field or whether it was in uh, acting. Because, you know, he, he was an actor with over 32 movies to his credit. Just a, just a great man, even from that to the stuff with Muhammad Ali in terms of that coalition to oh, yeah. decide if Muhammad Ali really was trying to dodge the, you know, the war or was he really true about the nation of Islam, which we now know. But he it was him, Malcolm X, uh, and Jim Brown, Kareem Muhammad Abdul Ali. Jabbar. Yep. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Yep. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Uh, and who was the singer? Uh, oh, I got him, Sam Cook. Sam Cook. Sam Cook. They all met in that one night in Miami. One That's night what in it's Miami. called. One night in Miami. And uh, you know, and I actually know Jim Brown well. And obviously, I know I did not play in the '60s and the '50s. But and this is the picture. This is from our good friend Ari Mayroff. Uh, sad news: legendary Browns running back Jim Brown has passed at age 87. Like I said, ripped to uh, not one of the greats. I mean, to me. It's Jerry Rice and Jim Brown. Like, I won't even entertain anybody else, and that's just me. You can say what you want, so it's Jerry Rice and Jim Brown for me. But when I got to Cleveland, Maz, the Cleveland Browns hired Jim Brown on staff to be the go-between guy. So basically, the players could talk to Jim Brown. Jim Brown could talk to ownership and management. Ownership and management could talk to Jim Brown. Jim Brown could relay those messages to players. So you're talking about from 05 to 2008, I've had many of conversations. Man, you're lucky. Not, not all of them good conversations. Yeah. You know, Jim Brown was one of those guys. Did pulled, he young man you? Listen, young man. Shit, young man my ass. He grabbed me by he grabbed me by, he grabbed me by my collar one day. But it was funny. I used to play this game with Jim. He didn't know I was playing a game. It was just me. Because Jim Brown's neck was so stiff from, I mean, you're talking no pads. You're talking bare minimum pads. He couldn't move his neck. And so I used to play in golf outings with him all the time. And then I, I would do, like, on-site uh, community service events with Jim. Jim moves like this. Huh? Hey, yeah. Hey, 17. <laughs> hey, Edwards. What, where's Edwards at? Edwards. 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 Oh, man. So what was funny is I just would always move. Just a little bit to opposite which way he was See, turning. And one day he caught on at a golf outing, and I was doing it. And he was, hey, 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 now what you want to do? No, on your shot, on your. God damn it, that was weak. <laughs> he was mad. That's as awesome, hell. man. Excuse my friend. That is there. awesome.